listen, Tex, before the next match starts. So, Tex, tell me true, what's the deal with American powers, the Bell Council, the front office, the War Games match? And what about Naomi? Ah, tune in tomorrow for it. Love of Chair. I love that bit. <laughs> you guys been hanging around me too long. <laughs> All right, well, long story short, too late, there was a long online sit-down between myself, Steve Groves, Colin O'Toole, his father, Seamus, and the rest of the match committee. Uh, and then we kicked it up to the big boss, Jack McLeod, Scott's dad, over at uh, the CEO's office, and, uh, well, here's what happened, in short, in a video capsule that he has presented this evening. Well, let me keep this short and to the point here. American Powers requested a war games match against the Bell Council tonight. The problem is that Patty Powers and Daniel Heathcote are still recovering from injuries from matches they had last month. The entire match committee, myself included, all eight members voted unanimously no against this. We're not jeopardizing two of our top stars, two triple crown champions, for the sake of viewership. We'll think about that later, somewhere down the road. Tonight, American Powers will compete in a normal standard tag team match against two members of the Bell Council. Each side can have one neutral person at their ringside. As far as the Bell Council goes, win or lose tonight, they're transferred to my lousy son's Southwestern Division. Thanks very much. Please enjoy the rest of the show. Give Brandy Knox credit for anything, but she did that that point about extreme matches and being pushed off Everest and fighting and burning nuclear power plants. So she kind of had a point it had gone too far. And in my heart of hearts, I really didn't want to vote yes on this. And uh, I'm glad the whole match committee said no to it because uh, both kids they've had just about enough, really. Kind of have to agree. American Powers didn't win all that gold in extreme style matches. They won them with wrestling skills, and Patty and Danielle have already proven themselves above and beyond the usual. It's time to stop the stupid war between them and the council before someone gets hurt, shaved, or both. <laughs> 